What's up guys, Bionic here with a quick video this morning on Raid Shadow Legends and today we are going to look at the new desktop application which looks fantastic. In case you guys don't know already, you can download the application on Plarium Play or basically just install the launcher and it will give you the option to uh, download the game. And I know they also put a link on the official Discord server so you could always access it that way. So first thing I want to cover real quick is the new settings. As you guys will see, you can now adjust uh, the graphic quality. You can go into advanced mode. This will give you a lot of options to play with. Uh, by default, this is what I had on my computer. You can also adjust the frame rate where you could go from 60 FPS to unlimited. Uh, unlimited did seem to put a little bit of a stress on my computer. I'm not sure if that was just a fluke, but uh, 60 FPS is, is more than enough. Uh, and you can also set it to um, 1080p or less or whatever uh, works for you guys uh, and also full screen. Uh, but I do like it in windowed mode right now because you can easily access uh, other applications on your computer. The next thing I want to talk about is how fluid the game is right now on the desktop application. Things like accessing your um, gear menu is so much better which in the long run is going to help you guys save a lot of time because I know that on my phone it became very annoying when I was trying to navigate the menu it was sometimes clunky, it took a long time to load up so I just felt like I was losing a lot of time trying to upgrade my gear the next feature is the shortcuts Z opens up your uh, shop I believe X opens up the index C opens up the champion vault or uh, inventory V opens up the challenges I see here the B opens up uh, nothing N is the playtime rewards then A to G doesn't do anything H does the clan then we got K for the progress missions and then I believe we're going to have Q for the uh, quests after that we have probably E, yeah, E for the events and then do we have anything on R? We got, yep, the special offers page specifically, okay. And then we got T for settings and uh, none in here and I for inbox, makes sense. All right, pretty cool. All right, and now the next thing I want to cover is the new graphics uh, options or new graphics effects, I should say. So they added things like new HD textures, higher frame rates, new animations, occlusion effects, tearing animations, motion blurring, and more. And you can clearly see this on this run right here. Uh, like the motion blurring right there, uh, it does look like the overall game, uh, like I said, is a lot more fluid. Uh, and I'm not too sure about all the new animations, but um, so far it is looking pretty fantastic. So that's it guys, just a quick overview of the new desktop application. Like I said, you can go on the official Discord server and use the link they provided right here to download it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to subscribe or leave a like. Catch you guys later.